Winds up all the left and picks that out. LaPointe inside the blue line. Canada getting organized. LaFleur takes the shot. Leppard and stops that. The rebound is scored. Well, again, Bernie, the power play of Team Canada, which has been 9 for 16. Of blue line to Marcel Dion. Dion going in with Esposito and Dennis Potvin. Potvin takes the pass over to the far side. Here's Orr. Shot. And a good defensive play. Hull gets the rebound and left it and stops it. Then it's a score! Howie Hull! Oh, rien ne semble pouvoir ralentir l'élan de l'équipe Canada. Et Phil Esposito marque un but à partir de derrière le couvert. Portant le compte à 3 à 0 après seulement 7. This goal by Bobby Hull made it 4 0. His great speed slips him in. And beyond the finish defense, one motion of the shot went behind Matson. Au cours des années passées, l'équipe Canada était forte à l'attaque, mais sa défensive manquait de cohésion. L'équipe Canada 76, aussi forte à l'offensive, montrait plus de solidité à la défense. Et Bobby Orr serait un pilote. Gilbert Perrault, on the face-off, wins it, and sends it directly to Potvin. The pass catches Martin, who slashed the puck beyond Matson. That goal made it 7-1. Esposito, Esposito to Mahovlich, right back to Esposito. In front of the it's playing on the right wing, and he makes a nice little backhand dump pass into the middle. Espo takes his time, gets the rebound. Perrault, who takes the pass, in over the line, right in front of the goal. There's a shot. Checked by Sitter. Sitter, all by himself, right in on goal. Shoot, score! The opening period, we played four and a half minutes. Here's Bobby Orr. Up to center ice for Canada with Hull. Drops it back to Marcel Dion. Dion to Esposito. Esposito gets it. He scores! Well, again, that group of Dion, Esposito, Hull. Presented to the top player on each team following tonight's game. Dennis Potvin, number six, feeds it into the corner, shot, tries to return it to Mahovlich, hits it back to the line, here's Orr, winds up, Lepresh and stops, and the score, Mahovlich, on the rebound, Peter Mahovlich, Bobby Orr taking the initial shot, and Mahovlich getting the rebound, putting it past the Presti, and it's two to nothing for Canada. Esposito, number seven, watched by Fatorik, backhands a pass, and Lou Nanny intercepts in front of his own net, Back to Milbury. Milbury for the USA. To Telephone. Stopped at the line by Potvin. To Dion. In front to Holy First time in the series a goalie has been pulled, and here's Bobby Orr with 32 seconds. Sargent at his own blue line, watched by Barber, clears it to Telephus. 25 seconds remain, the net is empty. Barber runs into Telephus. Norris goes in to help him out. 18 seconds remain. Sargent, he checked. Here's Sittler, shot, he scores! Forced to go back inside his own blue line. Bobby Hull's on the ice. Potvin down the left side. In over the line. A long pass on the far side. The on shot. And Ostrom kicks at him. Esposito lets it go. He scores! Bill Esposito. Ostrom went down and it slid between his pads. In on the left side. Drops it back. And Ganey just failed to get it. Stick on that as Hedbear comes back for Sweden. Nielsen lost control of it. Here's McDonald over the line. A shot. And a good stop. The rebound. The score! Davey! For Canada. Up to center ice. Over on the left side. The shot. He's shot. And it's wide. Peter Mohavlik.
Thomas going in after it. Both teams back at full strength with 22 seconds remaining in the period. In front, the up Well, here we had Peter Mahovlich being very smart, jumping in, taking that puck. With the puck. Larry Robinson in over the line. Here's a chance. Oh, Sitler let that one go. And I believe goaltender Ostrom got a piece of that. Or to Ganey, and Ganey clears it into the corner. Right in front, here's a chance. Ganey shoots, he scores! Well, Bob Ganey's not supposed to be a goaltender or a goal scorer, but he comes up with a second goal. And over the line, here's Hall Scott. And a good defensive play by Luchenko as he got his stick on it. Potvin inside the line, right in front of LaFleur. Guy LaFleur, number 10, back to Potvin, his shot to four! Deflected in front by Perrault. But that outside the blue line, Hall lets it go. Perrault in front, back to Potvin, into the corner to Perrault, and the hole! Team Canada up to center ice, a long shot wide off the target. Two minutes and 38 seconds remain to be played. In behind the Soviet goal, Clark right in front, Barber's shot, and Gusev stopped that. Clark will try again, gets it back to LaPointe, he lets it go. Oh! corner. Back to Palakias. Linker had that pass go right by him. Aberman is over the line being chased by Hall. He flips it out in front and Bobby Orr is there. Dion. Dion had it go by him. But Robinson one hand to pass ahead for Hall. Hall over the line to Perrault. Perrault getting room. His shot. He scores! He'll get the rope put it right between Zerilla's legs. Well, Zerilla didn't quite get them together. The point behind his own net. For Team Canada, over for Potvan, Potvan ahead, past Ganey, all the way down the ice, Sittler moving in after it, and it is waved off, any icing, Sittler gets after it behind the net now, trying to find a man out in front here, Potvan shot, he scores! Canada leading two to nothing. Esposito on the power play. Out over his own line. Over for Bobby Orr. Orr hits the line. Orr getting skating room. Orr going right in. He shoots. He scores. Bobby Orr. And they just let him go and go until he had that great goal scoring opportunity. Well, Bobby Orr used Bill Esposito as a decoy. The check of the back of the team gave too much room. Now out in front again. A shot. And that one Tremendous action and pressure around the Czechoslovakian goal as Pollock starts out. Stopped by Orr. Orr getting at the shot. That shot. And my got blocked and he scores! The third! Just tremendous pressure, Tom. Took him out of the play. Esposito around the boards to the far side. Leach. Leach having trouble controlling it. Aberman moves in. It's cleared past the goal into the corner on this side. And Keiko goes after it along with Esposito. Esposito trying to control it. He does. Out to the point. Here's Bobby Orr winding up the shot. Goal! Behind the net, Gila Floor goes all the way down the ice. Dennis Potvan back for it. 
We have a minute and ten seconds remaining in the minor penalties. Buckman, a lead pass to Guy Lafleur at center to Gilbert Perro. In over the line, right in front of the goal. The shoot, score! As he caught the bottom right-hand corner. When they do head man the puck, when they do break for open spaces, they are doing that, and they are creating near chances, at least at this point. And we played three minutes and three seconds here in the opening period, and it's Canada one, Czechoslovakia nothing. Phil Esposito, shot four! Esposito! And it's two to nothing for Canada. Seems to go into a great hush because you can never be sure what's going to happen. And from the draw, Halupa behind his own goal. Bobby Hull takes it a shot. There at the doorstep, Daryl Sittler tries to get it out for Canada. Two minutes and 23 seconds remaining. Halinka intercepts. Bobby Clark will try now for Canada. Clark just dumps it into the corner, leads in after it. Leads behind the goal and plays it. Three seconds remain, and the puck is sailing down the ice. Savard and Peter Stashley back for it. Potvin takes it ahead to Lanny McDonald. Marcel Dion to Sittler. Sittler gets by, right in on goal, a shot. 